Hey everyone, my name is Taha Abbasi. I'm the CTO here at Ferrum Labs, the company that has been developing software and solutions to remove barriers to the mass adoption of Web3. One of our largest protocols that we've built and contributed to is the Ferrum Network Protocol. Ferrum was born in the bear market of 2018. Born in the bear market, Ferrum has learned to not only survive but thrive to multiple bear markets through its technology solutions and revenue-based funding model that has followed for many, many years. We'll be doing a race for Ferrum here in a few months. Uh, in about a few weeks, we're starting to release out our decks and share with the world all the things that we've built out and all of the amazing things that we look to support in the future, including adoption of Bitcoin L2s, including development and research and research and development in regards to OPCAD, BitVM, and figure out which mechanisms will become the dominant mechanism to settle and verify L2 verification on-chain on Bitcoin and so much more. But let's talk for a minute about what we've done over the last six years, what we believe in, and where we want to go. Ferrum's story is a story um, that is a story of resilience. It's a story of longevity. It's a story to build for the long term rather than the shiny object syndrome. Ferrum has already been around for six years and we're not going anywhere. We've built when our token was an all-time high and we've built when our token was an all-time low. The token price, while um, it does impact obviously the market sentiment, but it doesn't impact our passion and our ability and our desire to continue to champion Ferrum's cause, which is a cause to bring together everyone who is building in Web3, bring them together through our resources and help gear that vision towards furthering the adoption and removing barriers to the mass adoption of Web3. So what is it that we are building now? We've supported many, many causes so far. Over the last six years, we probably helped raise directly through our incubator and indirectly through our advisory uh, division for about a thousand projects over the last six years. Um, now, some of those have been uh, a very select few of those rather, I should say, perhaps less than 100 of those, which means under 10% have been internally advised in incubator projects, where we take a project's idea, advise them on how to structure their project legally and with local compliance regulations in mind, how we get the marketing resources, we provide them technology resources, and we help them form a team and advise them to go launch their project in the space, whether they want to launch on the EVM side or if now they're looking to launch on the Ordinal's Rune side, we're happy to help projects navigate that ecosystem. Ferrum has also been building its DeFi solutions. This DeFi tech stack includes staking. It includes derivative tokens, uh, such as the Crucible product that we have where one token can be uh, converted into another tax yielding token, which can further add utility and other benefits to your product's ecosystem. It can allow you to have a governance mechanism. We've also deployed our bridging mechanisms and integrated multiple L1s. And now we have launched uh, and backed a multi-swap protocol, which is a decentralized protocol for allowing swaps across different chains. And we've done this in a decentralized manner where anyone can contribute to this protocol. And Ferrum Labs continues to pioneer the cause of building technology solutions that will enable data and uh, data and value interoperability across different chains. We are just getting started. Now we're starting to roll out the firm network protocol nodes, which are gonna allow you to run nodes yourself and earn rewards as a person who's working to secure this network, as a person who's working to enable an infrastructure that brings all these chains and brings all of these projects who are trying to build a multi-chain product together and through Running these nodes, you're able to secure the network's infrastructure and also earn rewards from the Ferrum Foundation's monetary policy that has been announced uh, about a few weeks ago in terms of how those rewards will be shared out. So there's a lot of exciting things coming. I would encourage you to stay tuned to our channels. If you have any specific questions about what we're working on, what's coming up next, I encourage you to check out our roadmap and follow our socials because we'll be sharing a lot more content in regards to each one of those items and those updates are gonna help you get more informed about where we're headed and hopefully join us in our journey.